what I'm gonna be doing today. Oh my god. Um, <laughs> I forgot my intro. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you are happy to be here as I am. I Apparently I can't talk today. No, I'm not gonna cut any of this out because why? Why? Why bother? <laughs> okay, anyway, let's just get to the point of this video. As you can see, this is my planner video, as you can tell from the title right up there. Right up there. Anyway, and make sure you check out the description box below. There's always goodies down there. Um, I am going to be showing you my planner. Thumbnail. Are we done yet? Okay. <laughs> Anyway, guys, this is going to be a planner video. Um, I'm basically, I'm going to run you through everything that's in my planner. And this has saved my life multiple, multiple times. Like, I'm dead serious. It saved my life. Um, I love this planner so much. Uh, let's start with where I got everything. This is the planner itself was like the binder part with the little strappy here. Was $3 at Target in their dollar spot. They have a bunch of cool ones. I'm sure this summer they will have even cooler ones, which I may be changing to because why not have multiple little things to put my stuff in? Make it cooler. Yeah. And you could always get one of these, like, I think they sell the little binders at the dollar store or Dollar General. And you could always, like, deck it out however you want it to be, too. Which, if they don't have cooler ones at Dollar Spot, is what I will be doing. To, I mean, I love this one. That's why I picked this one. You know, plan on it. You know, it's so cute. But... I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what I decide to do. You, there may be a video. Okay. So, this one is the first, when you open up my binder, this is the first little um, insert that you see. This was actually a DIY one. I took the big um, Target Dollar Spot has full size binder, um, binder inserts like these. They have full size ones for regular size binders. Um, and they had little pockets on them. And that's what this came from. This was the binder. What the binder looked like. This was what it said on the pocket. So I cut this down to size for this binder. And cut the little saying out. And just taped it on there. Yes. Okay. So that was that one. And then this is my little like. Um, let me go to one that doesn't have like my work schedule and stuff on it. This is my calendar insert right here. So I just go through and I write the numbers of each day and then, you know, like the each day's numbers and, you know, all the date up here, the month or whatever. So this I have yet to use. I just literally just cut all of these out and stuck them all in here yesterday. So I just got this part done. Um, this is my hour by hour for each day. What I did is I, it comes, I got this from um, scatteredsquirrel.com. Oh, I'm getting ahead of myself. These come from Target Dollar Spot. They are $3. You get this, and then you get another, like, weekly thing. Um, like, it says Monday, and then it has lines to write on Tuesday, you know, so on and so forth. I didn't really like that, so I got the hourly one, and I got another one that I'll show you from Scatter Squirrel. But these come in uh, $3. You get the monthly, the weekly, and then you get, like, a notes pages, too, to go with your binder. But, okay, so let's go to this one. This is my other little DIY binder insert that I did. Same thing as the front one. Sorry, I'm like rushing through this because like I'm so excited. But this I got from scatteredsquirrel.com. I will make sure to put the link down below in case you guys are interested for this. You, If you have a small binder like this, print the half page one, the one that has two of these on each. Um, and if you don't want to hole punch it on the opposite side, what I did is I just hole punched it on one side and I cut them out and taped it to the other side, the paper. I just taped the paper to this side. As you can see, there's a little bit of an edge, but yes. So I did get these. I am, I'm not taking credit for this. I got this from scatteredsquirrel.com. It's a free printable page. I will put the link in the description box below. So if you are interested, make sure you please go check them out. Not sponsored, by the way. <laughs> So not sponsored. I wish. I, I would totally sponsor them. I love them. I get pages from them all the time. Um, this is one that came in a package. You get th For $3, you get a bunch of these little planner inserts. This one is one of the ones with a pocket. This one has a little pocket on it. I'll show you the rest of them that I have. 
Okay, this one looks a little weird when you open it. It's like this. I have to put a page, a page flag in here. I actually hole punched it on the wrong side. So, yeah. This is my weekly, like my weekly what to do and, you know, things like that. If you have like an Aaron Condren planner or, you know, those expensive ones. Uh, they have one of these where it's all like bigger and then it comes with like stickers you can put in there and plan for your week and you know things like that but I'm not that bougie so I have the same thing but I also got this from scatteredsquirrel.com I will make sure to put the link in the description box below again if you have a little planner like this make sure you get the half page one and this one like I said I hole punched it on the wrong side you just have to hole punch it on the opposite sides so that it opens up like this and you can see the week across so Whew. okay this is another one that i got in that little packet of three dollars with the little pocket ones so from target dollar spot it says stop wishing and start doing which i thought was perfect for my habit tracker i don't have one filled out for this month yet um but normally i would put the date up here like the month like it's april of 2017 so i put april 2017 here list all the things that i'm tracking like um, whether I check my weight, if I eat healthy, if I eat junk food, if me and, you know, like, if we had a date night, if I was sick from work, um, you know, whatever. Whatever I'm tracking here, my water, you know, did, did you drink at least three bottles of water today? Did you work out? Did you go to the gym? Did you take your vitamins? That kind of thing. <laughs> did you read a book? You know, if you're in high school, did you do your homework? Did you have homework? Um, you know, did something exciting happen? That kind of thing. Um. And then I have it in halvesies because I have a because I have a small minder. What I did is I made these personally. Um, I just took a ruler and measured out a bunch of days, and then I made sure I just made a whole bunch of lines. And then I went back in and did the little boxes. I made sure there's 31 days for each and every single little habit tracker that I have in here. Um, and then I'll just make copies if I need more and cut them out. So anyway. <laughs> I did 31 and then I cut these in half. Oh, sorry, I didn't do 31. I did 16. Correction, I did 16 of these and then I split them in half so that, you know, it comes out to be like 30, I think it's like 32 or something like that, but whatever, still same thing. So, um, yeah, and then up here I would just write one slash two so like I would shade in like say I went to the gym on the first I would shade in this little top box and if I went on the third it would be this little second and then the fourth would be the one below that per line so I if you get what I'm saying but yeah so that's my little handmade habit tracker that I did uh, I also have a handmade weight tracker that I did so I just made this myself and then made copies of it and I also have like an original copy that I keep in case I do need to make copies um so yeah I just made that again with just a ruler and some handwriting <laughs> oh this is my other one love this life that's the other one that I got in that little packet and then here's another one no time like now uh the one thing I don't like about the the Target planner like page things they don't come with a contacts so I made mine <laughs> I just made a contacts thing so let me know if you guys would be interested in any of these because I might figure out a way I could figure out a way to like put them on like a PDF or something and put them on like my Instagram or my Tumblr or something and you guys can have them that way but and then I have this little one that says, let's go, which is perfect for the next thing. I got this at Goodwill. I found it and I said, you know what? That's really cool. Like I'm always constantly forgetting things when I pack. So this is perfect. <laughs> what it is, it is, it says, I, I love to travel, but I hate to pack. It's a packing list. You put, you write your destination up here at the top and the date. And then this one is a list of clothes, toiletries, like you know bandages contacts perfume sunscreen lotion medicine shampoo floss all the stuff you need to have uh electronics like your mp3 player your dvd player your ipod you know your phone your chargers whatever and then any documents that you have like any of your like airplane tickets your gas money your 
passport, whatever you might be needing. So I thought that was really cool and I had to have that. So I think it was like 49 cents. This is a handmade one. This is from another binder. Um, I just cut it out. I didn't put anything on it and it's just plain blue on the back there. So this one I have in here just because I really, I, I always finding books that I want to read and then I forget what the name of them, them are. So I made a, I just took, you can go to Dollar Tree and get those little um, legal pads that are tiny, the little itty bitty ones. Um, they're like half size. You get two and one for a dollar, so they're like 50 cents a piece. And then I just hole punched them according to these right here. And to get the hole punches in there, in case you're wondering, all I did was I took one of my little binder inserts that come for this planner and I just stuck it on the pages. Um, took pencil and circled where the, the holes line up. And then I just took a regular, well, like, one at a time hole punch and hole punched where I had circled. So that's how I did that. This is another one of my DIY ones that I did, DIY little inserts. This is my quilt wall, which right now I don't have any. <laughs> I haven't really been working in my planner as much as I would like, so. And then there's another little DIY one with blue on the back. And this is the other pocket that I got in that packet of pockets. And then there's another one for you. So that is the end of my planner for now. I'm sure I will be adding to it again. There is a bunch, a bunch, a bunch of scattered squirrel stuff. Um, planner, scattered squirrel stuff. There is a bunch of pages that are half pages, which I plan on getting, just saying. Um, a bunch of half pages on scattered squirrel. You can get monthly pages on there. You can get daily, weekly, monthly. I think you can get cleaning pages, budget pages, I'm pretty sure. I will put the link down here so that you guys can check it out. And if you decide that, hey, you know, that's what you want to do. You have a printer at home, you can print your own pages, cut them out, hole punch them in, you're bad boy. So, I hope you guys didn't... <laughs> okay, I can't talk today. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Um, and make sure you subscribe to my channel so you know when I post videos. And there's a little bell that will send you notifications of whenever I post. So, make sure you press that. <laughs> make sure you go check out my March favorites video too. The link will be in the description box below. I do mention this. It's a prelude to this. But you already watched it, so what do you care? But go watch it anyway. <laughs> Alright guys, I love you so much. Thank you for watching. Bye.